Welcome to Smart Culture. Hey, don't forget, hit the like button down below and subscribe to our channel. In this video, we'll look at the mammalian kidney. First, we'll look at this diagram and then we'll move on to the dissection of the mammalian kidney. Let's start. Take a look at this biological diagram of the mammalian kidney. The renal capsule is a thin sheet that covers the outer surface of each kidney. Now remember, the internal structure of the kidney consists of two main regions, the cortex and the medulla. So the cortex is basically the outermost region, and the medulla is a darker region of tissue below the cortex. Over here we have the renal pyramid, and on the left we have the renal pelvis and then the ureter. Let's move on to the dissection of the mammalian kidney. So this is then the kidney of a sheep. I've adjusted the camera for you to have a closer look. Sheep have two kidneys. They are bean-shaped organs and they play a major role in the processes of excretion and osmoregulation. With this specific kidney I have here, the renal capsule has already been removed. A renal capsule is a tough, semi-transparent membrane that covers the outer surface of the kidney. The rounded side of the kidney is referred to as the convex side. The indentation of the concave side of the kidney is called the hilus. So let's start with our dissection. The first step is to use the scalpel to cut the kidney in half. Open the two halves and carefully separate the tubes that still connect the two halves. Notice the differences in color between the cortex and the medulla. So the first part that we'll be looking at is the renal pelvis. The renal pelvis contains the hilum. So the hilum is the concave part of the bean shape where blood vessels and nerves enter and exit the kidney. So the renal pelvis is also the exit point for the ureter and it also connects the kidney to the rest of the body. The kidneys are surrounded by a renal cortex. The renal cortex is a space between the medulla and the outer capsule. The medulla is the inner region of the kidney. It consists of multiple renal pyramids, which are triangular structures that contain a dense network of nephrons. Let's just have a closer look at the renal pyramid. As you can see, here are the renal pyramids. Let's just quickly recap. So the internal structure of the kidney consists of two main regions, the cortex and the medulla. So the cortex is the outermost layer of the tissue in the kidney and is situated beneath the renal capsule. The medulla is a darker region of tissue below the cortex. It is divided into triangular structures called pyramids. For online tutoring or additional resources, visit our website, www.smartcultureeducation.com. Don't forget to subscribe.